Good light, take three, hopefully it will work. Is it recording? Yes. Okay. All right, so um, this is a balancing routine. We're going to balance for like three minutes, and it's going to be easy. And the reason why I'm doing it in jeans and the reason why I'm doing it on this rock is because this is stuff that you don't need anything special for. You can just do it anytime, anywhere, okay? And balancing is a muscle. You can build it as you practice. So we're going to start here in Tadasana. Your feet are hip distance apart. You're pressing down with the ball mounts of your big toes and the ball mounts of your pinky toes, finding evenness between the insides and the outsides of your feet, finding evenness between the fronts and the backs of your feet. Take your kneecaps into your quads. Your quads rotate inward, shins rotate outward. Your pelvis is stable. Your lower ribs go down and back. Your shoulders go up and back. Chin comes out of your chest. Head flows like a balloon. This is alignment. Even though I'm not on even ground, I still feel like I'm in alignment. All right, so now we start balancing. So lean your weight onto your left leg and pick up your right leg. And if it's easier for you, you can just bend your knee. Otherwise, try and straighten your leg. That's a little harder. Take your hands out like this, or you can take your hands to your heart. Balance, coming from here. And then make it a tree, tree pose. Or like that. Either way, our balance is coming from our center. And then here comes the big one. Back forward. This is warrior three, Virabhadrasana three. And if this is really hard and you fall and you have to hold on to something, that's okay. That's really normal. This one takes a long time to develop. And take that leg that's in the air and put it behind the leg that's on the ground and come down into a forward bend leg behind your other leg. And then shift your feet so they're back into Dasana even. Scrape your fingernails on the ground and come up into Utkatasana chair pose. Again, it's that same feeling of balance that's coming from here. Come all the way up. Arms come up over your head. Exhale your hands to your heart. Refind your Tadasana. Evenness in the feet, inside corners, outside corners, front corners, back corners. Kneecaps come into the quads. Quads rotate inward, shins rotate outward, pelvis is stable. Lower ribs go down and back, shoulders go up and back. Chin comes out of your chest, head floats like a balloon. Then your body weight to the right now. Pick up your left leg. And if you want to do like that, that's also fine. This is a little harder. Take your hands up. Take your hands to your heart. Whatever you like. And then make it into a tree. Now with tree pose, I forgot to say, either we want to have the foot down here below the knee or up above the knee, but not on the knee. And the reason for that is that we're just, in yoga, we try to be really gentle with the joints, particularly the knee. Good. And here comes everybody's favorite dive forward, warrior three. This pose is a lot, and it feels like a lot for a long time, but just keep sticking with it. It's a really great glute workout. It's a really great leg workout and a really great back workout. Good. Okay. And then take that leg and put it behind the other one, and then come down into a forward bend. each other and, and then take your feet side by side again and this is Uttanasana forward bend just a regular forward bend and if you want to you can take your hands above your head like that I want to do this if it feels good releasing the shoulders and inhale your arms up over your head exhale your hands to your heart that's it, namaste.